Hello and welcome, I am Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more FTL Advanced Edition. We're going to play as the Lanius crew people again. We're going to try to actually do one of these, these achievements. I want to try to unlock Type B. Can't even see what it looks like. It's a secret. We're going to try to do this. So, loss of cabin pressure. Good. Get to Sector 8 without your ship's net oxygen levels exceeding 20%. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so we just basically play without oxygen. Um, scrap hoarder, have at least 600 scrap in your ship storage. Okay. And then advanced mastery. So this one, you have to have hacking, mind control, and battery active at once. That one we can probably do just by getting to the end of the game. We just, just force ourselves to do that. Scrap hoarder, that's a lot of hoarded scrap. And then loss of cabin pressure, we just, okay, that'll be interesting. We'll try that. So we're going to play on normal mode again. Probably should do it on easy mode if I really wanted to succeed, but... Alright, so let's just immediately get used to the concept of we're not playing with oxygen. Let's just turn off oxygen. Um, just not, we're just not going to do it. So if this guy dies, if Karis goes away, then Karis goes away. If she dies, then she just gets reincarnated. It's cool. I already have a store, so let's uh, just start jumping around, see if we can pick up some scrap before it's time to go. I want to get a, a crew teleporter, like right away. Let's aid the Federation ship, sure, why not? Some fighting is fun. Now we can expect there's definitely going to be crew in the cockpit, so if we hit them with the ion stunner, it'll also prevent them from dodging the next blast. So do the chain gun on the weapon. They shouldn't have any evasion right now. And they do. Either he stopped being stunned or it doesn't work the way I thought. Possibly. That or actually because the ion hit the shield room, it might have not targeted that room. That's probably more likely to have been the case. Oh, you know what? Starts after the first jump, so we already have over 80%. Okay, let's start over. Restart. Okay, so if we're going to do that achievement, I think we have to turn off the oxygen now, and let's just vent the ship. I think I miss... Yeah, I think that this is necessary. Alright, then we just leave the oxygen off. Um, I'm just... Yeah, I don't... I mean, it'd be really hard. You, you could just hang out in the oxygen room. You don't belong here. You're in the wrong ship, man. All right, we're going to skip that store. There's just, we, we won't be able to buy anything from that store. It's too early. Hacking. Once you arrive, your screen lights up with warnings. Your hacking system automatically counters it. Cool. All right, so we have no oxygen. That's the thing. That's the main rule. Let's try this again. It might actually be better to let the chain laser fire first and then fire the ion stunner no he took down my weapons how dare you oh you're about to die that's sad you might as well help repair we gotta get these things going of course he did he did a ton of damage I think for certain people, depending on how like lazy you are when it comes to managing your crew, um, this button might be really good. You know, the return to stations and the clone bay are pretty solid. Alright. Just fire. Great thing is you don't have to worry about fire. We should probably repair the shields though. This is not working out so well, so far. That first shot, taking out our weapons, is really making this first ship kind of hard. Far harder than when I would have expected it to be. Oh no, he's dead! Who cares? <laughs> You're a filthy human! I just want a crew teleporter so badly. I think that's what we need. I wonder if I can rebind that key to something a little bit more proximate to my fingers than return. Return is kind of far away. Um, we'll see. So we gained some stuff, took some damage. It was not fun. She's probably going to die again. It's to be expected. What's the, uh, what's the achievement called again? Loss of cabin pressure. I like it. Goodbye, Karis. 
Okay, we'll send somebody else to help us jump. We should probably... No, we should just wait. We should wait for her. I mean, really. She's special. Artyom. She's going to go through a lot of lives. <laughs> She's going to be dead all the time. Okay, after a short time, you receive a message. Hello, I hope it's not a bother, but I'm looking for an escort. This region is quite dangerous. Sure. Added a quest marker to our map. Okay, that sounds fine. Let's um, see if we can hop away, hop along this, this sector pretty quick here. Oh, obviously, we're going to attack it. Here's a laser drone. Just shoot at the thing, you know. There's no, no people on board, so it doesn't matter. Karis is about to bite the bullet again. Kick the bucket. Have some problems. You know what I mean. Goodbye, Karis. You'll come back. Don't worry. We won't leave without you. Unless, of course, that thing gets shot, in which case you're dead. Yeah, we, I mean, there's a very real risk that if that thing got hit right now, she'd just be dead. And I wouldn't really be that upset, because she's just going to constantly be annoying. Keep on dying. There has simply got to be a button. Cloak is C. V is teleport, I think. No, that's T. Maybe, um... Investigate the station. Oh, yeah, that was totally worth it. Okay, next jump. I guess enter works. It's just it feels funny to me. You receive a hail from a station orbiting a nearby planet. We are in need of assistance. Yes, we have assistance. Attempt to scan the planet. We apologize and continue on our way. Continuing on our way then. Prepare to board. Sure. Got a whole bunch of stuff. Cool. Into the nebula we go. Attack the pirate, of course, always. Every time. Teleport over, I dare ya. Oh, you're in there. Let's get him. Get him. Where'd he go? He's fighting. Oh, they're in the oxygen room. There's no oxygen in our room. Hey, dude. What's up? We don't have oxygen here. Return to your stations. Yeah, I think, um, yeah, I don't know. I should probably just keep the ion stunner always trained on the shield room. Shield or the weapon room, I guess. I don't know. It's hard to decide, really. Keeping the shields down seems pretty important. Unfortunately, Karis is going to die right before we're supposed to jump. And we have to wait for her. She's so high maintenance. Did you get alive already? <laughs> I don't think we're going to do the scrap hoarder thing right now. I think we need to, um, you know, probably buy some things. Level 2 shields would be kind of nice. Unfortunately, there's no real good way to get there except for going straight for it. So we'll go north-ish a bit, up-ish in that general direction. Intruders on board. Well, you're going to have a hard time on our ship. We'll just ignore them. I mean, whatever. I don't think they're going to... I mean, they might do some hull damage. Yeah, they took down that thing. Oh no, they're going to take out our oxygen. What are we going to do? <laughs> now you know what it's like to be a Karis. If we could just pick up some more of these guys. I want to have a crew of eight of these guys. Bye-bye, Karis. We'll see you soon. Yeah, I guess we should probably help me help evade a little bit. And that's probably not very important. Let's fix stuff. The weapons thing is pretty important. It just seems to be taking forever to do any real damage with these guns. Now, boarding party. That would be pretty cool. Because <laughs> they go over there, 
and they not only do damage and fight people, but they also take oxygen out of the rooms that they're in, so... There's just... that's just awesome! You know, I don't, I'm not even going to repair the oxygen room, it's just more system damage we could take. If I repair it, someone's going to come damage it, and if they damage it, we take, take all damage. And I'm just never going to turn it on, so... Let's just leave it damaged. Seems fine. Seems perfectly reasonable to me. Explore it, of course. Always take the active decision, I think. Just trying to sneak through the sectors just doesn't work, because you don't get enough scrap. You have to fight. Damn. Our metal ship just got hit. Goodbye, Karis. We will miss you. <laughs> no! She's dead. Probably more important than 5% more evasion. Maybe, maybe shields are more important than invasion. Accept their surrender. Seven scrap, three fuel. We don't really need those things. Nice music. I do really like this clone bay. It's a lot of fun. Maybe we should upgrade the clone bay. If we did upgrade it. Oh, we can't upgrade from this this location. I think we can do this. Karis is about to die again. Somebody do a death count. How many times has Karis died? She's certainly not going to be a highly skilled individual. <laughs> Think about all the f all the weapons that fail against us now, like fire bombs, fire beams, fire drones. Like none of them do anything. Ah, sure, we'll accept. Why not? It's a, not a bad offer. But we're not going to fight the rebel ships. They are very strong. Hey, man, what's up? Just leave all the doors open. The vacuum of space. Shouldn't you be able to suck them out? Uh-oh. Karis might die. Oh, no! Karis might die. <laughs> no! Karis, don't die! For real! Save her! I'm pretty sure if she dies while this thing is damaged, she's dead. Dead for real. How long do we have? Okay. Either we just barely made it, or there's a little tiny bit of leeway. I'm not sure. I know that there's an augment that will let your crew be safe. I would like to have a couple of these things. Ah, uh, missiles. Missiles just don't interest me. Bye-bye, Karis. Twice this jump, really. Goodbye! I'm so sad. So what if we did upgrade the medbay thing? What does that do? Clones faster. Hmm. That's okay. Doesn't really interest me that much. I'd rather have another weapon. We need to find a store. Lack of cabin. Loss of cabin pressure. Indeed. Every window, every door, they're all open. Upgraded the reactor by one. Wow! You arrive at and the ship. You arrive, and the ship you were escorting jumps in behind you. Thanks for the help. We work at a nearby fusion power plant. We could try to improve your reactor's output as a form of compensation. So that would have been even more valuable if we had already been high level. Um, but 20, it's worth 20 scrap, not bad. You probably would have got about the same amount if we had fought somebody, but it was free. 
Okay, there are a number of privately owned ship construction platforms in the area. You have to upgrade your reactor in exchange for some scrap. 17 is less than 20, so... Um, it would be really nice if we could have upgraded that again. But yeah, 17 scrap, upgraded the reactor by 1. So that's twice now. If I had, had already upgraded this, then we could have gotten 50 scrap worth. 25 times 2. That's pretty nice, though. Let's jump to the next sector. NG controlled. Sounds good. Let's go check that out. Loss of cabin pressure. And there's a store. Let's go to the store. Give me weapons. And if not weapons, then let's repair the ship. Okay, so crew teleporter. Oh, yes, we have to get it. Chain burst laser. There's a second one. That is a really tough call. Another chain laser would be so cool. But then again, crew teleporting just seems awesome with a clone a clone bay. We gotta do the crew teleporter. We just gotta. Crew take half damage from low oxygen. So if we sell this, then our friend Karis is gonna die even more often. Is it just our crew? Or all people on our ship, I wonder. Well, doesn't really matter. Let's fix the ship up as much as we can. We're gonna pass up the respirator. Or the, uh, the thing. Chain lightning. Chain gun. You know what I mean. Hey, another store. Let's try to bounce around a bit and maybe catch that store. I don't really see a good path, though. We'll do two jumps and then we'll go do it. Participate in the study. 11 scrap. Let's fight. Okay. So from now on, pretty much these guys, this is your new home. You can just, yeah, sure. Whatever. And um, we'll keep that powered. Let's say that this is your saved position now. And just, just go over there. Go to the med bay. They'll drain the oxygen from the med bay, I hope. Maybe the med bay is not the best room. Yeah, no. No, 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 no. Let's go to the oxygen room. Oh, we should still probably fire at him, shouldn't we? Our guys are going to die. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm going to get the hang of this. Got three online. Please... No! Oh, crap. Oh, no. That's not good. Oh my god! <laughs> that was quick! <laughs> that is not how you're supposed to do it. Okay, so um, here's what we learned. Still shoot your weapons. Don't fight in the med bay, even though the idea of taking down the oxygen in the med bay is good. You should probably take out the oxygen room first. Death by asphyxiation. Um, and yeah, you need to have shields up, otherwise the med bay gets dead quick. Or the clone bay. So. Right, well, I'm going to take a break here, and in the next video, we will try again. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you soon.